Today's question, how do deductibles, co-pays, co-insurance, and maximums work? The simple answer is they define the different ways health insurance companies pay most of the costs to keep you healthy. It's a little complicated at first, but not when you understand how everything works together. Your deductible is the amount of your medical costs that you have to pay before your health insurance begins to pay. These amounts can vary dramatically between different plans. Here's an example. Gina has a health plan with a $1,500 deductible. If Gina only has a few little things go wrong during the year that cost less than $1,500 total, she's going to pay the full amount to treat them. However, if Gina has a catastrophic injury or serious illness that requires a lot of medical care to get better, she'll pay her $1,500 deductible and then her health insurance takes over to pay most, if not all, of her additional covered costs. Often, plans with higher deductibles have lower monthly premiums. The exception to deductibles is preventive care like annual physical exams and routine gynecological visits with in-network doctors, which are covered by most plans even before meeting a deductible. Sometimes, even after you've met your deductible, you may still have to pay a copay. A copay is a set price that you pay when you visit the doctor, a small portion of the total bill. Copays vary by policy and can change if you see a specialist instead of a regular doctor or seek treatment out of your provider network. Prescription drug coverage may also have co-pays, which can be higher for specialty medicines and lower for generic drugs. Let's say Gina goes to the doctor with a case of mono. Her doctor charges a $30 copay, and when Gina fills her prescription, she pays a $5 copay to the pharmacy. Her out-of-pocket costs are $35, and her insurance company will reimburse the pharmacy and the doctor for the difference between the copay and the cost of treatment. Some plans have coinsurance, which is the way you and your health insurer share the costs of your care after you've met your deductible. For example, if Gina is injured and she's met her deductible for the year, her health plan will pay 80% of the cost of the rest of her covered expenses, leaving Gina responsible for the remaining 20%. Maximum out-of-pocket is the most you could be responsible for paying for during the plan year for covered expenses. So to sum it up, Deductibles are the portion you must pay first before your insurance pays its share. Then you pay only a small portion of your health care costs, either a set copay amount or a coinsurance percentage. Maximum out of pocket is the most you will pay for covered treatment in one year. So now you know. Until next time, stay smart and stay healthy.